Hey there, my spooky, scary skeletons. It's Chloe in real life, and welcome back to another episode of my Halloween Spooktacular. So, they say breakfast is the most important meal of the day, so why not make it spooky? These two items were actually suggested to me by a viewer, so a big shout out to her. Thank you, Anne, for suggesting these because I like breakfast and I like spooky stuff, so why not combine it and have a spooky breakfast? So let's try these. So the first thing we are going to try are these Entman's Pop'ems. They are pumpkin donut holes, but I'm having a lot of fun saying Pop'ems. So that's what I'm going to call them. So let's open these up. And these aren't pumpkin spice. These are just pumpkins, so maybe it's a little different. That smells good. It smells... It does smell pumpkin-y, but it still has kind of that cinnamon smell. So I think this will be slightly pumpkin spice. It actually smells a lot like the pumpkin spice latte from Starbucks. Oh, do you know what would be really good? Donut, these pumpkin donut holes with the pumpkin spice latte. And then everything could just be pumpkin. So here they are. They smell really good, so let's try them. Oh my gosh, wow. Okay, wow. There's a lot to talk about. First thing we need to talk about is how this box is going to be gone by tonight. <laughs> so, the second thing I want to talk about is how these just like melt in your mouth. No joke, when I took a bite of them, it just like melted and it was just pumpkin-y. And it did have a cinnamon taste, and I do really like that, because I really like pumpkin spice, and sometimes pumpkin just on its own can be a little sickening for me, so the mix of the cinnamon is really, really good, and I would really, definitely recommend these. So, now let's try the pumpkin spice Cheerios. I really hope these are good, because I could only find the family size, so I really hope I like them. And I really like that Cheerios is doing a pumpkin spice flavor because it's healthier, but you can still celebrate the holiday. <laughs> Get some trusty scissors. It doesn't really have a super strong pumpkin smell, it just smells more like grainy, like normal Cheerios, so let's try them. So here they are. They look just a little bit more orange than the normal Cheerios. Now they smell a little bit more pumpkin-y, so let's try some. Kind of sad. They kind of just taste like normal Cheerios, but just with a little bit more cinnamon. And I'm kind of disappointed. I was really expecting this because I love Cheerios. And I really wanted some, like, pumpkin pop. <laughs> and this doesn't really have it. It's just kind of normal Cheerios with some cinnamon on it. All right. Not giving up on the Cheerios. Hopefully, I might unlock some pumpkin flavor with some milk. So let's try it. Ah, there's a it's too full. <laughs> it was too full. It was too full. It was like I wasn't expecting all those Cheerios. Okay, it's breakfast time. Gotta stir it up, get the Cheerios, get the pumpkin flavor unlocked, and hopefully, let's get some milk on there. Hopefully, it'll be magical. Okay. The milk definitely makes it taste more pumpkin-y. So I'm glad about that because on their own they're a little, they just taste like more cinnamony 
normal Cheerios, but I definitely prefer it with milk because it definitely tastes more pumpkin-y. All right, so those were the autumn breakfasts. I really like the pop-ums. I love them because the glaze on the outside of the donut was really sweet, but the inside wasn't. So together it just blended nice and it wasn't super sweet because I know sometimes it can be sickening and this definitely wasn't. I would definitely recommend picking these up. The Cheerios, I'm a little sad, weren't as pumpkin-y as I wanted them to be. They were definitely better with milk, but they could have been more pumpkin flavored. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, a comment, and don't forget to subscribe and be sure to check out my Halloween Spectacular playlist because then you can see all of my super spooky and awesome videos. So don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at ChloeNewell910. And I will see you all next time. Don't forget to stay spooky. Bye-bye.